Godgame.com, all the game you want and then some. How the fuck did that happen? There's a fireplace! Jesus Christ! We have to get her warm! She's gonna freeze to death! It's just gone. It looks fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. It's my fault. I, sh I should have stayed with him. I said I started to go. There wasn't nothing any of us could do. I'm trying to help him. He just... Oh, God. You son of a bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny, don't, man! To what? I'm freezing. Can we just get a fire started? Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit, too. What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You fucking commie piece of shit! Yeah, Kenny! Fuck you! You mother! Fuck the fuck! Let him go, Mike! Get the fuck off of me! There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is gonna help How me? is beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. I'm tying him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? These hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh... You got a light? I thought I had matches. Take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. The fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this, this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. Well. I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. 
I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Clem. Just be careful. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. Daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean son of a bitch. But he taught me respect. A girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. I like her. Just give her some time. Maybe you're right. Hell, I didn't know what to make of Lee at first. Of course, he helped me in mine more times than I can remember. Jane helped us back on the road. All right, give it a turn. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road really make some distance. Wellington's gotta be out there. Now those rumors can't all be bunk. Sounds good to me. We're gonna make it, Clem. I know it. All right, turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! We'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. And Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! I've seen that look before. Son of a bitch! He'll be fine. Clem, he beat that boy within an inch of his life. We are way past fine. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. 
I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Probably had a nice job and a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Seems like you've done that before. It's not rocket science. I feel like I'd drop it. Okay, I'm in charge of the baby holding. There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. They had to try, right? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky, like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. He got it working. It works? what I tell you? So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're gonna freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry, we did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man, this is fucking nuts. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arbo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. We should ask him what he wants. There's a concept. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. God damn it! Kenny, are you okay? You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. God damn it. God damn it! 
damn it! That stupid fucking... Get the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem! Sorry, just... Give me a second. 